This is Wayne Bombstead, the Crossbow Hunter, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Come with me now as I travel to Argentina to hunt the mighty Asian water buffalo with my crossbow. This hunt takes place in the grasslands of South Central Argentina on February 2022. The Asian water buffalo was introduced to South America in 1895 and has since established itself throughout most of South America. Each day the hunt began early as we walked and stalked the buffalo. We would walk several miles each day in our quest to find a big mature bull. We encountered many nice bowls, but none were of the quality that we were after. So we headed to another ranch, a couple hours drive to the south. Okay, are we now on the property? Now we have a bumpy road all the way over. Right up ahead over that hill, and that's where the property starts. Okay. You know, our game plan for today is to uh, find where the buffalo are going. Yes, sir. We have pinpointed a couple of uh, water holes where they will usually show up. And uh, we'll try, first of all, finding their tracks and, and, and try putting a stock on them. If that doesn't work out, we'll wait for them at the water hole. Okay. On the drive to the lodge, we saw this large flock of rheas. They are a large flightless bird native only to South America, and they're much like an ostrich. Manuel? Beautiful place. After dropping our gear off at the lodge, we headed on out to see if we could find the buffalo. It didn't take us long to find some buffalo, and the spot and stock was on to find a big one. It looked like all the big bulls were in herds of cows and calves, making it nearly impossible to get close enough for a shot. After a couple of unsuccessful stocks, we decided to wait them out at a water hole. Manuel had set up a pop-up blind near a favorite watering site. After checking out the site to make sure no buffalo were there, we moved in to get set up. This watering site was also shared by some of the ranch's cattle and of course a lot of other wildlife. Soon after getting set up, we got blessed with the rare sighting of a pair of Patagonian Mara. A curious Argentinian fox decided to check us out. A small group of immature bachelor bulls also came in early. Even a small immature red stag was looking to come into water. 
And then finally, just before dark, a large herd of buffalo came in and it contained several mature bulls. And there's our target bowl. Just look how much bigger he is compared to the rest of those full-grown buffalo. Something spooked him away from the water, and I got ready to take my shot. The shot looked good, and after retrieving the arrow which had broken off, we saw that we had about 18 inches of penetration. However, we were going to have to wait till morning to go look for this bowl. After spending a somewhat sleepless night, morning was finally here. Before going out to look for the buffalo, yeah. Manuel invited me to partake in South America's number one social drink, Yerbo Mate. And then it was off to find my buffalo. The blood trail was nearly destroyed by all the other buffalo feet. But we did manage to find some blood traces. We caught up with the herd that he was with, but he was not with them. Then we got a radio call that he had been found by the other group that was on the search. When we got there, I could not believe how massive this animal was. Paco, amazing animal, amazing animal, uh, called an Asian water buffalo. Yes, sir. Correct? Yes, sir. And this beast, I, I don't know how much it weighs. It's, uh, it's the biggest buffalo type animal I've ever shot. It's bigger than our moose. It's bigger than a Cape buffalo. Oh yeah. It's just massive. Not one you'd want to have chasing you around the woods. Not at all. And uh, we had to let them, we had to wait until morning to to get on them, to find them because we shot them just right at dark and he ran off and you don't go running around at night trying to find an animal no. like this. No. Anyway, Paco. We got him. Enjoyed it. We got him. Enjoyed him. it. Thank you. Pleasure Thanks. hunting with you, Wayne. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel.